Hi, I'm Greg Foley. I'm superintendent at Hickory Point Golf Course. Uh, we've been here 20 years this year in August. We're just going to talk real quick today about some of the behind the scenes stuff about golf courses. Uh, golf courses are very unique. There's no two that are, that are exactly the same as far as the requirements that they have, the, the, the turf that's on them, uh, the amount of play, their budgets, weather, uh, your water supply, your water source, uh, your climate in general as far as how much rainfall you get in here. One of the biggest factors that I talked about was water. Uh, that has more to do with the playability of the golf course than anything. Uh, whether it's water management from the superintendent standpoint or water that Mother Nature provides. All of our water at Hickory Point comes from wells. Um, we don't purchase any water, no city water used. Um, we typically use about 23 to 28 million gallons a year, and that's, that's an average. One of the things that we do is, as we limb up trees, on our cypress trees especially, is we'll, we'll reuse these cypress logs to make tea blocks out of it. So we'll cut them, bevel the edges like that, and paint them up, and that's the final result. So, they last us quite a few years. Uh, and then we'll put a couple nails in them, paint the ends of them. There's several things that they can do. Uh, one of the biggest is, is uh, just obeying the, the guidelines of what we've got for restrictions on the golf course that day. Uh, they're not set to be detrimental. They're, they're set to protect the golf course and to, and to uh, provide the best product that we can. Um, one of the biggest things is spreading out wear and tear with golf cart traffic. Uh, right now, with the way things are, with the single rider restrictions that we've had, uh, we're seeing a lot more cart traffic this summer. Uh, and that's detrimental to the fairways and turf in general. So the more we spread it out, the better. So if you see a set of tracks going there, try to just spread it around to where we're not just constantly running over the same area. Provide a good product for the people behind you take care of those that are coming and playing behind you. Um, the general raking out the sand traps when we do have the rakes out, uh, but mostly just kind of being conscientious, I guess, of other golfers. 